Understanding, Saddened by the News, a guide for English language learners. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a common English phrase that you might encounter in daily conversations, news articles, or social media, saddened by the news. Understanding phrases like this is key to enhancing your English comprehension and expression. So, let's explore what this phrase means, its usage, and how you can incorporate it into your own conversations. The phrase, saddened by the news, is used to express a feeling of sorrow or disappointment upon hearing new information or updates. It's a way of sharing your emotional reaction to something you've learned, usually something negative or unfortunate. The word, saddened, indicates a state of sadness, a step beyond just feeling sad. It implies that something has caused this emotion to arise. The news refers to the new information received, not necessarily from a news outlet. It could be any update or message received from someone or somewhere. This phrase is versatile and can be used in both formal and informal settings. Here are some scenarios where it might be appropriate. Reacting to global events, when discussing natural disasters, conflicts, or other tragic events reported in the media. Personal conversations, sharing your feelings about someone's unfortunate personal updates, such as a loss or a difficult situation. Written communications, in emails, letters, or social media posts to express sympathy or condolences. It's a respectful way to acknowledge someone's pain or the gravity of a situation, showing empathy and understanding. To help you better understand how to use, saddened by the news, here are a few examples. I was saddened by the news of the earthquake in the region. My thoughts are with those affected. We were all saddened by the news of Mr. Smith's passing. He was a beloved member of our community. My family was saddened by the news that the local park will be closing down. It was a place full of memories for us. Notice how the phrase can be adapted to fit different contexts, always conveying a sense of empathy and shared sorrow. We hope this video has helped you understand the meaning and usage of the phrase, saddened by the news. It's a powerful way to express sympathy and connect with others during tough times. Remember, learning to express emotions in English can significantly enhance your communication skills and help you form deeper connections with people. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more English language learning tips. See you in the next video.